uh, Exhu, which is how he just told me how to pronounce his name here. Exhu versus Leon. Leon Space returning Station back to Gaming. MSM. Leon. Yeah, Space Station Gaming. I believe they just played in Valorant recently. That's cool. I don't really watch Valorant. That's cool. But, uh, yeah, Leon back in top eight again of MSM with the Bowser game. It's always nice to see the best Bowser play work offline, online. doesn't matter. I love watching the I love watching heavy characters just to see how they, you know, get around the, the character's weakness and really just make these matchups work. That's what makes it interesting for me. And that's what's but, crazy uh, about Bowser too. He's kind of like a he's he's a pretty much a grappler and having the extra weight as well. You have to be really careful because you do have to pay respect to like if you poorly cross that Bowser, if you poorly aim an aerial, he will get that whirling fortress, he will get the up smash, he will get that grab. And then you're gonna be taking either zero or a stock. Sorry, 20% or a stock, and it's going to be rough here. But so far, X2 able to just kind of maneuver a little bit around Bowser. Great opportunity to come back on the stage with a neutral air. Pokes the shield here, but unfortunately Ooh. on the roll. I mentioned the up smash. You have to respect it. Bowser just has way too many options to just bully you at the ledge. He has the F tilt. He has the up B, the up smash. All of it works really well for him. Yeah, particularly and down in this tilt. matchup. X2 kind of wants to play a little bit more space than aware, like he did there. Went for Boomerang, went for Nair. You just want to keep it tip for tap, never anything too aggressive there, because if you do misspace something, you're, there's a lot of damage you can take. Oh, X2 going for that forward smash one, mix up on shield again, seeing if you can catch Leon slipping. Unfortunately, he's not gonna, uh, he's not gonna bite there. And honestly, this doesn't look like a bad matchup for Bowser. He has the range to kind of deal with Link, and he eats up a lot of hits. Where he most does. characters would not want to tangle with Link, Bowser doesn't really seem to have that problem. I okay. would. I want to say, X who will will want to abuse the projectiles even more than he did yeah. in the. You want to play more match. of this as a zoner than you want to do with somebody who can just box and not necessarily box an opponent out, but just go for neutral. Definitely more zoning here. Oh. Finally gets the bomb here. Eighty percent. Leon with such a lead. Oh. Man, I thought Leon was going to do something nasty with that bomb. Yeah. Oh, neutral air? Oh, yep. He got a little bit too preemptive with that. Oh, wow. Leon snuck in a hitbox of his own. X2 yep. wasn't able to get any low percent string at all. Okay. Yep. He's where the bomb's going to shield that. Yeah, and that gives X2 a little bit of time to come back on stage. Having the bomb on stage, specifically around the ledge, is good because your opponent has to worry about interacting it. He hasn't had time. And I like how somebody in the chat points it out. Why no arrows? Bowser's kind of staying a little bit closer, so X2 hasn't had the opportunity to go for an arrow, but I eat my own words as he finally puts one on the board there for you guys to see. That's going to oh. be a grab. Oh, and the uh, stock. Yeah, and even Heavy Link's going to die to that one. The platform assist might have played a factor there, but either or, Leon's placing that uh, flying slam in really good spots. It's always scary when the Bowser player conditions use a shield too, because then that uh, flying slam is going to be even more effective. Clean 53% from the forward air to... Uh, grab up throw uh, so much percent already and here's the flame breath as well Has Leon no business looking doing so good percent. another whirling fortress from the parry yep good for him to next big hit should be enough yeah X2 with the boomerang here on the retreat enough to kind of break through on the ledge but he still finds himself in disadvantage bomb to force Leon to hold the shield but unfortunately Ooh. that call out because he sees the aggression from X2 and Leon taking game one Hitbox placement at the ledge is on point from Leon. He's just making it so whenever he has that link at the corner of the stage, he, he just feels threatened all the time. Yeah. I, I want to say that was not necessarily a good stage choice for XU to go to Battlefield. You typically want to have a bigger stage because in this matchup, you, like I said, you want to play this more of a zoner. You talked about its strides. You kind of want to use boomerang, arrow, bombs a little bit more instead of trying to approach an opponent with, uh, with bear. I'm sorry, with with neutral air or something like forward air. And you, you kind of want to stay space from Bowser because that flame breath is really good for him. But also his ability to punish you out of shield and punish your landings, especially from a commitment like a poorly spaced Nair, can be really difficult for Ling to deal with. So something like Boomerang Fair may be better in the cards for Exu. And definitely something like playing the more with punish game and forcing Bowser to come to you is better for him but we'll see how it goes man because it is a best of five in this situation and it's going to be game two for x2 and leon 
Yeah, let's see. Let's see what Xu does here in this game. He's picking Smashville. Uh, let's see. I, I expected a bigger stage to see maybe if we're going to try to keep Bowser out a little bit more, but maybe he can uh, make some more aggressive plays work on a smaller stage. We'll see. Exactly. Well, that's the problem here. That aggressive play oh. from Xu was already really poor. Oh. Tried to go for neutral air. Tried to go for roll get up. A little oh, bit too man. aggressive there. And that neutral air was punished by the Whirling Fortress. Yeah, he almost died from another up smash uh, from rolling in. Leon yeah. got a really good scout on that. Oh, gosh, the roll at the Rolling Fortress. He's making his life so hard at the mm -hmm. ledge, and there's an F tilt. He tried to get that reverse up B to see if he can catch Leon slipping. No dice. Leon, way too aware of that. And uh, this is a huge lead for Bowser. 39% yeah. might as well be zero. Exactly, because you can see how like, oh my. that flame breath is so good for Bowser because look at how much damage it does to Link. He's looking for <laughs> that whip punish because he sees that neutral air. Like I said, Exu kind of wants to play this in more of a zone here, but finally a little space between him and Bowser and the jump read here, enough to give Exu the ledge and hopefully the stock here, but no read just yet. All right, looking for an opportunity here. Boomerang. Leon kind of keeping his feet planted to the ground here. He's able to go for two jumps here. No grab. X2 looking to commit Leon to something here, but he can't find much. Once again, using that Z-drop on the bump to kind of slip through the crack. Have to be careful with that Nair. If Leon calls it out, Oof. that is going to be the stock loss for X2 at 62% even. Bowser's got crazy damage with Rage. Some good bomb placement for X2 right now. And see, he's trying to use the projectiles a little bit more. Yeah. Doesn't want to do anything super unsafe on Leon's shield. Yeah, so he's he trying can... to like use the use the projectiles to create an opening where he can actually attack Bowser safely. Oh, he drops shield on that whirling fortress again. Oof. Ooh, the <laughs> so fast reaction of that like drift off stage. But oh. There's the shield break. Just push him off the stage. Yeah, that uh, that force smash actually does some decent shield damage. So. Not too surprised to see that one, but uh, yeah, it's shield break aside, he still needs to do a lot of work to bring this back. I'm surprised x didn't go for a down throw uh, full hop Nair, because even though it's not necessarily going to throw him off the stage like he's probably looking for, it's going to do opportunities on Bowser, where full hop Nair like that, oh, he, well, he went for down air, but full hop Nair is really true on characters that are heavyweight, but also it can lead to a tech situations, and if you time it properly, you can, you can get another Nair. And that's good damage to have against Bowser, especially when you're trying to come here. But he gets a little bit of a shield cross up, sneaks in a neutral air, trying to kind of slowly mix in his approaches here. I talked about how if you poorly space that Nair, there will be a Whirling Fortress, and that's good for Leon. Oh, there's a Flying Slam. Oh, okay. I thought he was going for the stock trade there. Control the bomb. Oh, he yeah, wanted to see if he can get his bomb to like push him inside. Yeah. Of the stage, so we can get an up smash. Still not enough. Big heavy Bowser's gonna eat up all oh, these hits. Oh no! Early Z jump on the bomb. Hey, waited just a second. That probably would have caught Leon here. X who looking for an opportunity. Good on the forward air because he can't get that yeah. neutral air, and it has just enough range to slip through that shield. Okay, Axu, careful on the landing here. Able to slip through with that roll. Boomerang, no fair, but he's able to call nice. the high jump. Great play. Down air, not enough yet. Go yeah, this is break. actually a really good positioning on stage for Axu right now. Yeah, he... Oh, I'm <laughs> saving there though, but he falls out of the last hit. That's yeah. good for him. Look okay. at Axu. Look at how playing as a zoner definitely working out <gasps> for him. Now he's got the even stocks, not a lead here, but if Axu can pull out two more interactions, he would have found himself <laughs> a game here, but that's going to be Leon. Dang. Game number two. That down air was so unexpected. Rough spot for Agassu. Like I said, two poor stage choices here. Really crucial for this matchup just because, like I said, I understand the aggression. You really want to be in Bowser's face. You can stop his recoveries with bomb, with down air, with nair, you name it. Big problem here is that if you misspace anything, if you whiff anything, if Bowser reads your hard approach with nair or anything like that, you will be punished, and that damage that Bowser does to you with Rolling Fortress and Up Smash with the grabs will eventually turn into a stock after two interactions. So you have to be very cautiously aware of how to approach him 
Towards the end, I did like how Axie started to slowly understand the matchup and approach this more of a zoner. We'll see how game three treats him here. Big shout outs to you. Of course, sweet underscore Lou. Good to see you here in the chat, my friend. And great to have Arrow three, alongside in the chat as well. One, We're back on Smashville, though. This is x whose potential last game in the winner's bracket. So I would like to see more of what we saw in that last stock from x -Hoo. He looked like he had a lot of control of the game, even though he was you know, trailing in percent. He was really keeping Leon in some bad spots. And uh, yeah, that's what it takes. You just can't try to force the approach against a player like Leon. No, oh. you cannot. There's a you reason why that up B is called Whirling Fortress, but Bowser is a fortress himself. And yeah. half of the whirling is the up yet a shield. Great opportunity for him to go for the Z jump on the on the bomb. Not enough to do it, but now Exu with the control and the grab. Okay. Bomb at the ledge here. Oh, he didn't keep the bomb on stage, unfortunately. But some opportunities. It's gonna fade back on the nair. Oh, oh, doesn't get the back he's looking for, but he still swings the down smash. Man, I, I thought Leon missing that nair back air would be enough for Exu to regain some stage control, but he doesn't end up dying to that down smash immediately. I do like the X2 okay. is now calling out Leon for going for those down airs as Bowser because he's about, uh, this is how Leon got to 120. He called out two of those dares with his up air and now Leon is playing a little bit more cautious of how he tries to come back on stage. Excellent Worldly Fortress. X2 has to be very patient at the ledge here, but he sneaks in his own down air and this is an edge guard for X2. Can he put something here to work here? Unfortunately, he missed the timing. Yeah. If I'm X2, I would keep the bomb at the ledge as long as possible, especially versus Bowser, but... There's the hero spin out of shield. First yeah. time seeing that from X2, actually. Yeah, you can, uh, I talked about it. You angle the shield, and then you're able to punish your opponent better, and then also avoid getting shield poked as well. You can up B, which is an excellent DP for Link. One of his best out of shield options here. I mean, you can see Bowser doing it too, right? He's going for that Whirling Fortress. Bomb, nice play. A little bit of pressure there, but not enough here. Trading spaces and trading the stage here. X2 with the stage to be held. Can he get the opportunity strides? Like you said, I want to see more of that bomb play at the ledge, but he drops it here, giving Ileon a little bit of a chance on the stage. Yeah, it's a very peculiar that he uh, doesn't apply it that much pressure at the ledge with the bomb. He tends to just throw it off the stage, see if he can like blow them up before they uh, touch the ledge, but it seems much more difficult to ledge trap that way. Okay, he doesn't get caught with a flame breath. That's a great recovery from him. Link can also self detonate bomb to go for bomb jumps at certain parts of the stage. I haven't seen Xu go for those yet. He hasn't been put in a situation against Bowser where like, okay, his recovery might be susceptible. But still, it's gonna be something he might have to try eventually because there was a time that Leon was able to call him oh. out. Does it get the full hit of the reverse back? Oh no. Hero oh, okay. spin. Oh no. I thought he has D, but then he just died to the F2 anyway. That's a really unfortunate for Exu, he went for that reverse up B at the ledge, see if he didn't catch Leon slipping, but Leon's a little bit too smart for that, but the forward air, getting another kill for Exu, only 28%, well, 52% now. Oh man, he thought he had a free grab there, Leon seek three that option, back at the ledge again. All right, Exu, stage yep. here with the forward throw, no bomb yeah, like covering the ledge. He's doing a good job of trying to condition mm. the, uh, a B out of shield, so he's grabbing him. Yeah, but okay. look at that opportunity Exu had at the ledge here. When it took a little bit too long to go for some kind of neutral air or an aerial, and that gave Leon the stage here, and this is the situation we're seeing Leon with a lot of control now. Exu okay. took a little bit too long on that second jump to come up with something. Still gets the bomb, though. Give him some stage control back. Oh, nice movement, sneaking in the grab. Again, throwing the bomb off stage, he doesn't really opt for the ledge trap. So far, hasn't been uh, able to snipe Leon with that bomb. Okay. Need some good hitbox placement. Gets the forward air. Oh. oh nice. Finally, straight, some though. edge guard. Finally, some good food, guys. Finally. And the call out <laughs> on the neutral. Oh, my nice, edge. my spacing on the ebb tilt, too. Finally gets on the board there. Like Chef Gordon Ramsay once said, and I'll say it again, man. Finally, some good food. And Sue bursting out here on game three. Finally, a point on the board for Sue with the four tilt. That's kind of the one thing that got him the tournament winner against Colonies back in the early in the top 64 winners. Good stuff from the boomerang to call it out. But like, I, like you said, Strides, Sue's got to start committing to these edge guards with the bomb. That's free edge guarding. He is missing out. That's like living money on the table, man. 
if you want Bowser to stop coming up on the stage, yes, Bowser can hit the bomb, but you can also call that out. Yeah, it's uh Yeah, just by like like it's it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, it's just um Bowser is so big. Most of the like, big characters are pretty terrible at the ledge because like their ledge options are all very slow or his body's so big that no matter what he does, he can get caught by something. So it'd be good for him to continue just abuse that weakness as much as possible. Because like, otherwise, Leon looks very comfortable on this stage. Alright, we're back um, on Battlefield. I, I look, I'm gonna be real with you guys straight up right now. Not a good stage choice. We saw how this went well for Leon. But you know what, man? Exu is the one with the controller in his hands. We'll see if he can make anything happen. He finally got a point on the board. Definitely looking to download this matchup here because he stops Leon from coming with a downer yet again. He's been calling that out from last game. Yeah, Exu spacing very, very good in these last two games, I would say. It's been the difference maker. He's not letting Leon approach as easily as he did before. I definitely like how he's sneaking in these grabs as well. Nice. Get the jab two on shield. Oh, that roll though. That roll has definitely been the bane of his existence. Leon's been snagging that with the rolling forces very consistently. Oh, there's again. Now he finds himself back at the ledge. But oh, the second hit of the forward arrow not connecting. Oh, that back one into the F smash. Even yeah. big body Bowser's going to die. Nice stuff for X or X who catches the bomb with the forder as well. This is this is some of the best we've seen him play so far. Oh, there's that back air just fell on top of him. Didn't have the best eye on that either. Unfortunately for X who. Premature on that one situation here for Exu. He thought he was going to force Leon to go for a jump, but once again, catching him for being in the air. What a juggle with three uppers, man. He's telling Leon, I'm not going to let you come with that downer for free anymore. Yeah, great stuff. Just abusing that big body of Bowser, showing Almost why heavy struggle. Yeah, I, I like the four smash one on shield. A lot of shield pressure can throw in an F tilt for good measure as well. This yeah. is really, really good right now. For X who, oh, it doesn't follow up off the boomerang, unfortunately, for him. Oh, oh. That, was, that was a decently spaced forward air. He had just got, he barely tried to move away from it. But unfortunately, that was enough for Leon to get the punish here. Leon 169 here, X who, and if you can get another forward to a grab to the up throw. Actually, grab up throw will not work in this situation. So, get a bomb, a raw and air, up, got a shield. With punish, a missed opportunity there from the bomb explosion, unfortunately. Oh, he just threw him off the stage with the forward air. Okay, another mm. one. <laughs> so that was a situation where if he tried to self-detonate with bomb, he might have definitely made the recovery and not have to worry about Leon going for forward air. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't just blow himself up. Oh, well, oh in the, the devil, right? <laughs> throwing the bomb too. Up there? Oh. No, missed it just by a hair. Oh man, Leon betting it all with the forward smash, trying to get a disgustingly early kill at 33%. Oh, down there, just lingering just enough to kill at 200%. Exu trying to keep himself alive in this set right now. Okay. Oh, the flame breath is going to blow up the bomb. Not the best for Leon, but he still has the stage control right now. Okay. So, Roll gets caught again. Leon's been so good at catching that, either with the up smash or the whirling fortress. Yeah. Oh man, much percent taking out the ledge right here. Oh, he catches the roll yet again. He just keeps throwing him off stage. Nice, good, 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 good up attack there from X2. But unfortunately, that's going to be the command grab. Great DI oh, coming no. out from X2. One fifty. This is his last opportunity to stay in the winner's side. About the whirling fortress yet again. Won't let him get away with that roll, man. That roll has just been the fame of his existence right now. There's the forward air from the ledge this time, trying to mix it up a little bit. Ooh. Ooh, the air dodge punish. So clutch from X2. Brought He's... that all the way back. Oh my God. The He's... one time. The one time he stopped rolling off the ledge like a monkey, he he like gets the air dodge punish and gets the kill. That was that was what he needed, man. He just told him, "Don't sleep on me yet, boy. Don't you dare air dodge." That was that was really really good, really really good. Yeah, really good indeed, man. Leon with unfortunately trying to go for the air dodge off the stage, but Exu knows that downer from Link. 
has a very, very nice hitbox, but very good frame data on how long it lasts. It was actually, I, I don't think, I don't know, can't remember if they buffed it in one of the recent, recent patches, but uh, good stuff for him finally pushing game five. And now Leon with a little bit of a thought. If I'm a betting man, dude, I would definitely want Sue to change up the stages. But like I said, man, he knows the key to success. And so far, he's been able to push game five up against Leon. Like you said, Strides, he's got to stop going for those roll get-ups. Leon gets a lot of damage from that. He, I think he punched him for rolling on ledge like almost six times in a row. <laughs> Crazy. But uh, You got to learn at back, some point, right? We're back on Battlefield again for the game five. It can go either way. X2 has proven that he's able to adapt in this matchup. And honestly, I want to see what Leon's going to do because anyone would be tilted after losing that game like that. That looked like it was his game to win. Yeah, 70% already on Leon Exu with a lot of control here. Miss space there, and that's a good punish for Leon. I talked oh. about here. Yeah, but he didn't get the right hitbox of the Nair that he was looking for. Oh, beat, he weighing yep. out that, that Whirling Fortress on shield. Nice stuff for him. And that's a great bomb as well. He's trying to get all the pressure at off stage. Call jump. Yep. jump. Okay. And that's good Bonnet too faithful. because he threw Boomerang at that specific angle, so he's able to oh. call out Leon for jump get up. I wish huh? he did a harder punch than jab Forced there. The jump get up? Mm, no read, no read. Yeah, I think he could have killed from the boomerang hit at the ledge, but he did jab instead. Oh, nice. He preemptively uh -oh. tried to connect bear one to up smash, <gasps> and that's a no! suicide and the reset for Leon. That's what <laughs> oh, he, was... he could have gone out. He actually could get out from that. Unfortunate there for Sue. Oh, no. He had such a big lead. That was the biggest lead he had so far in the set and leon just said you're gonna do a bad up smash on shield once I i'm gonna make this an even game now a b no this is a good, good opportunity he didn't want to go for the reversal because you do stick out your hurt box as young link's hero spin especially when you go for the reverse one and that would have been a good punish for leon okay inspired that uh stock trade though um zoo's still holding on to the lead looking really Ooh, strong nice I and that's to the grab mm -hmm. okay there can lead it to grabs. Another Nair tech chase scenario. Sue so really well aware. Pressure there on the shield. Able to get so away. Doesn't yeah, it's such good pressure on the shield. So good. Oh, missing the tech on the platform. Leon's gonna get the double four there. Hold up. Did I just oh. say? Did I just say this is such a Wi-Fi link? Man, playing Link on Wi-Fi is not as good as it's not as easy as it seems, bro. I don't care what you guys have to say about uh, X2. This guy's playing really well against the best Bowser in the world. Yeah. Okay, so at the ledge again, I want to see if he rolls. <laughs> Will he roll? He can't even roll. <laughs> Leon doesn't even let it happen. And it's unfortunate oh, too because he has the bomb on the stage. So if he tried to go for bomb recovery, it wasn't going to be something on the board. It would have took too long to get the bomb back. Oh, nice. Not yep. in the kill though. Oh, he gets the arrow snipe. No bomb. Nice. No second catch. swing. Second swing. Yeah, he catches the high recovery from Leon. I think he Leon did an early up B to see if he can avoid all the bomb and stuff off stage. But X2 still capitalizing, only taking three percent back in a position to go to the winners' finals right now. Space snare. Finally, a space snare here for him. I actually got away from Leon. Unfortunately, not a good snare though. That's yeah. a rolling forges. But oh, he sneaks past Leon. Good bomb placement there. He looks at it too. Picks it up here for a little bit of pressure. Stops Leon from jumping. Great boomerang placement. Also looking for a jump. Gets oh, the call out on the check. platform. Oh, oh doesn't, get get out. doesn't get the grab either. Tough, okay. tough opportunity there for Sue. On the recovery, going for jump oh. here. Good pressure with boomerang. Forcing Leon to respect that a little bit. Oh, he's stuck on the platform. Gotta get out of there. <laughs> nice. This time, he doesn't go oh, for an opportunity. Oh. Trade space is double. Leon shield. He didn't want to get shield broken, potentially. All right, this is huge for Zurayo. Oh, the boomer to the pointer? No, no, no. State control. Z yep. drop on the bomb. Good oh, check on Leon. Tech. How's he going to get off the ledge? He jumps. Doesn't get the second hit of fair. It's going to be a... Oh, down throw. Okay. He wants the ledge trap. Oh, oh, that was scary. That was actually scary. He just got the hitbox barely enough to hit Bowser. Oh, this is so scary for both players. X2, though, he has a lot of pressure right now. But the big back here, no sweet spot. He's living. On oh, oh the Nair! The switch there! He got past the four there. Oh, my Bomb. God. Bowser's living, though. Oh, oh. he barely gets 
legend time. The bomb, you voice it. Oh my god. He tried to call the jump. Good, good on next okay. two. Great spacing from Leon right now. Oh, he no. gets the place but on the top is it enough? No! Still living, Link's still living. Okay. Careful on the get up, careful on the get up. Oh, nice. oh, he doesn't punch it. Oh my god, this is too close. I don't know what's gonna happen anymore. Oh, the no, shield the poke. Shield <laughs> poke. Oh, his shield poked. He didn't angle his shield. Oh my god, Exu with the upset over Leon in the closest game I've seen in a very, very, very long time.